stop eating junk. They're cheap, but they're not good for you. You'll definitely end up in the hospital if you keep at it. Hey! I eat other things too. Hey! I eat other things too. That's not going to work on me. And I saw it when you were cleaning your flat last week. The instant noodle cups outnumber everything else. You're just exaggerating. Did you even see what's in my cupboard yet? I'm not just living on instant noodles alone. I've got canned beans, peas, tuna, ham, and even hamburgers in there. Aren't those the same ones you won from the grocer's raffle more than a year ago? Oh, I sincerely hope you're checking the date stamps on those things before eating them. I don't in any case. Those are still not exactly healthier choices, Belle. <sighs> what am I going to do with you? I hope you know that it's impossible not to worry about you when you're like this. You don't have to keep eating the same thing. <laughs> Didn't I tell you before? You're always free to reheat my leftovers. Thanks, Becca. I really appreciate it, but you don't need to keep babying me. You've been taking care of me since after I moved here. You have to take a break sometime. And before you ask again, no. You know I'm not a fan of borrowing money. And I'm not going to ask you to give me what you earned hard for yourself. Ah, you and your pride. But suit yourself. The offer stays on the table, though. Well, enough chit-chat. Lunch is ending, and my students will be back any minute. We can catch up later. Good luck with your clients. You better treat us to lunch or something if you get that sale. You bet! sure you can manage on your own? I mean, you're still a bit feverish. Ah, oh, hush, dear. Don't you worry about me. I'll just drink some medicine and I'll be right as rain. You shouldn't even be working right now. <laughs> Seriously, you big baby. I'll be fine. For now, just go to work and stop making that rose girl wait for you. I'll call you if I still feel bad, and you can come pick me up if it makes you feel any better. Alright, but don't forget what the doctor said. Drink this on time. I'll see you later, okay? <laughs> Look who's playing the mother hen now. Rebecca! <laughs> okay, okay.
I won't tease anymore. I'll make sure to drink it, Mom. Zach? Yeah. He even called in the middle of the night just to remind me. No, don't worry. I didn't forget. I'll be there. Cool. I'll see you later. What time do you get off? Around 5, 6 p.m.? I don't know. It's the first day of the Ermengarde Mansion's open house, and we're expecting quite a number of potential buyers. I'll be booked the whole afternoon. Ermengarde Mansion? You know, the big Jacobean mansion at Anselm Village? I'm on my way there- On your own? Yeah, well, Rose is already there, but yeah. I see. Looks like the scaredy cat finally toughened up. Shut up! <laughs> I'll see you later. Drop me a call when you're done. Whatever. Bye! <laughs> 